Hi everybody, this is Miss JC and I'm coming today with um, a purple look for your eye that is very easy to do. I'm sorry, I got my brushes. Um, I don't know how well that this is going to go because of the lighting situation and everything. Um, let's try to zoom. Zoom in on my eye. Um, we have a medium color right here, a medium purple, a dark purple for your corner, and then a light highlighter for um, your um, brow bone. So let's get started, okay? Um, <clears throat> I bought brushes. I just want, um, as you guys know who watch my um, videos, I didn't have brushes at first, but now I do. So, um, we're going to try to keep up with more of the videos, but for those of you who are into makeup, if you guys could tell me what your favorite brushes are, it would be great. Um, this is what I'm using. Okay, it's by, um, Lancome. I don't know how much it costs. I'll try to, um, look it up for you guys. Um, because this was a gift to me, and I don't know where they got it and all that other stuff, Jayla. And I've had it for a while, but I just never really, uh, used it that much. Please excuse my daughter, I'm gonna try to speak over her, because she's in the bathroom with me. I'm gonna start off with, um, my eyeshadow brush, and I'm gonna take this color right here and I'm gonna apply it to my lid um, as before I'm still trying to find um, a nice primer um, so I'm still on the search for that, so if you ladies, um, know of any good ones, send me a message, comment, whatever. Let me know what you guys like, so I can check it out. Okay, so you're gonna put this on, um, until you get to the desired, uh, color purple that you like. We'll make sure you don't miss any corners like so again I'm sorry about the lighting because like on my camera I'm looking at it I'm like this looks kind of pink but it is indeed purple I will take pictures of course pictures will be at the end as I apply that I'm gonna take my crease brush and take some of this color right here and you want to start this off very lightly because you can always add in more I just want to start out right there and you do a little circular motion for it to blend I'm trying to make sure okay And you just add however much you want to it, or however dark you want to go. I saw one YouTuber say, always start off a little light, because you can always make it darker, but you can't really make it lighter. So I'm trying to make sure that is kind of the same with my other lip. Okay. So now you have a nice little smoky shade in the corner. I don't know where my daughter 
this shit's going, but okay. And then, I know that you're probably not supposed to use this brush for this, but this is what I'm using it for. I'm going to take my smudge brush, and I'm going to put it in this goldish color right here. Take your smudge brush and I'm just going to take it to outline the top part a little bit more. I'm just kind of bring it down. And so as my finished touch, what I do towards the end is I just go back to my eyeshadow brush and go back to this color right here. I'm just going to take a little and put it over in the brow and just work it real Making sure to get all so you don't have any harsh lines. Okay. And then, okay, because I'm looking at my eyes, and this one looks a little smokier than this one. So I'm going to go back and get my um, crease brush and go back to the dark color right here. And just doing circle motions. Okay. Try. I want to make sure my eyes are fairly even. Okay. And I think what's going on in my other eyes, like a little bit that goes across like that. And you guys, of course, can do that. Okay. That's why it's even this is going to get. Okay. So then I take my, um, you can take a wipe for a towel whatever, and I'm just going to. Clean up my eye. And this is my finished look. But, like always, um, my camera is doing some funky stuff. Um, you can. Take an eyeliner. And that's pretty much it. Pictures coming at the end. Bye.